Winning the MVP award isn't about taking it home a chunk of metal sponsored by Kia. It's about being able to hold the distinction of best player in the world over the competition's heads. Nobody cares about winning something. They care about the distinction that comes with winning that thing. They care about the title, the recognition, the honor, and that's what makes this move by the Philadelphia City Council so cringeworthy. Like, holy smokes, do you have to kick Joel Embiid while he's down? This man just lost in the Eastern Conference semis for the fourth time in the last five years. He just put his team on his back and carried them to a first round victory over the Raptors and put up a decent fight in the second round against the top seeded Miami Heat. James Harden was supposed to be the ultimate superstar teammate that Embiid needed, but Harden did not live up to expectations as has been the case for the entirety of his career. Embiid had to give everything he had on the court and still came up short, as was the case with the MVP award. You know what wouldn't help Embiid feel better either? Giving the Sixers a trophy that read, hey, you were close, or you're the league champion in her hearts. If anything, that would be patronizing to the team. They did not win, so they got what is essentially a participation trophy and a reminder of the fact that they came up short. That's exactly what Embiid's new distinction of most valuable Philadelphian does. Hey, you did not win the MVP, so here's this made up thing that should totally make you feel better. This resolution doesn't actually give Embiid any real title. He already had the distinction of best basketball player in Philly. He's already loved by the city of brotherly love, and I'm sure he's felt that love several times throughout his career. This distinction is an embarrassment to Embiid. If the city he plays for has to create something out of thin air just to hide the fact that he's lost out on the MVP award to a man who was drafted during a burrito commercial two years in a row, that should tell you something by the city of Philadelphia. It would have been better if instead of coddling Joel Embiid, the Philly City Council went after Jokic. They could have made it, I don't know, illegal for bars to serve Jokic in the city limits. They could have given Jokic a false title that makes him out to be the most hated person in the city of Philadelphia, which I'm sure Philadelphia fans hate Nikola Jokic. Instead, the council embarrassed the very person they sought to praise, Joel Embiid. I'm sure Embiid feels much better about the last month and a half with his new title. I bet he's gloating to all of his friends about it as we speak. But in reality, Philadelphia is the laughingstock for making up a participation trophy and title for Joel Embiid.